Find out how this company uses seatbelts to make a fashion statement. Live at 5 at 4 starts now. Well, do you ever wonder where certain things go when they are rejected? Usually they go to the trash, then the landfill, but one Knoxville company has been taking some company's trash and turning it into treasure. Tennessee Webbing is a local company that started in 1991, and we have actually purchased millions of yards of surplus webbing. When you think of webbing, it might not be this. A woven fabric that is used to produce a seat belt. Seat belts? This fabric was produced to save your life in your automobile. You know how long you keep a car? Sometimes you keep a car 30, 200,000 miles. That seems to be the only downfall with this super duper fabric. If this were to go into the landfill, it would be there for our lifetime, our grandchildren's lifetime. All these colors have been dyed specifically for the automobile industry, but... If they do not meet the very specific um, requirements, then they're rejected by the automobile industry. That's where we come in. The company makes harnesses for deer stands and the material has been used to make gun holsters and many other things. But a year ago, they went from belts to bags. We have gotten our own patent. Purses out of seat belts? About 90% of the population scratches their head and doesn't know what to expect. Maggie Bags was born, named after the owner's 19-year-old daughter. A lot of people really appreciate the fact that it is a recycled product, but some people just are excited because they're so cute. Now, when you look at all the colors, you might think that they are dyeing all of them. We have only dyed two colors, a hot pink and a light pink. Everything else is a natural seatbelt color. The lime green was made for FedEx, so the supervisors could see the drivers were wearing their seatbelts. The orange was made for the United States Postal Service, the exact same reason. And every now and again, we cut colors that we just scratch our heads and know that probably someone fell asleep at the dyeing wheel. Right now, there are six styles of bags, but they are growing. We're in over 450 stores nationwide, major catalogs. The prices for the bags start at about $60. One amazing thing, it is wash and wear. They're meant to last forever. <laughs> they are actually machine washable, and it looks like the day you got it. So an accessory that you'll always have even at 100,000 miles, and it was saved from the junkyard. This is pure recycling, pure repurposing, taking something that would have ended up in a landfill and simply cutting and sewing it and making it into a great, beautiful product that everyone can use. Aaron Donovan, live at 5 at 4. They are so cool. Yeah, probably pretty safe too. We're coming right back after this.